good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Josh Egbert. Meredith has the night off. The Lafayette family lost everything in a Thanksgiving Day fire. The family, though, got out safely, but flames gutted their house in the 1200 block of South 22nd Street. Star City's Chris Marisivica is live with more on this story. Chris. Battalion Chief Tim Ford says the department first responded around 430 yesterday afternoon when homeowner Tina Parker reported flames in the utility room at the back of the house. Once we arrived, fire was showing and uh, the guys went in, we got a knockdown on it. He says firefighters were there about two hours and left after they believed the fire was extinguished. But as the homeowner was sitting in her car assessing the damage to the back of the house, she spotted flames shooting through the roof. The firefighters returned after 7 o'clock. Ford says the age of the home and the type of construction made it difficult to find where the fire was smoldering. Bloom construction means the studs run all the way from a crawl space all the way to the attic with no stops. So once you get a fire in a wall, it'll go all the way up. Also in older homes, the plaster and lathe in the walls can hold the heat. Flames shoot through when oxygen feeds the burning material. So in order to find each smoldering piece of wood, firefighters essentially had to cut into every wall. It was in the walls. There's a lot of voids. There's been remodels. There was uh, spaces in the attics that had been added into. So it, it was a difficult overhaul fire. Last night, a fire inspector assessed the property and confirmed that the fire did begin at the back of the house. And today, Acting Battalion Chief Carl Stokes says the exact cause of the fire, though, has not yet been pinpointed. He does say that the house is a total loss. Now, full disclosure, I am a co-worker of Tina Parker's and uh, want to let you know that friends, though, have established an account at Old National Bank, the Tina Parker Donation Fund, to help the family get back on their feet. Anyone can stop by any Old National Bank branch and make a contribution. Also, the family belongs to St. James Lutheran Church, and the church is hosting a bake sale on Sunday morning to help raise funds for the family. Reporting live in Lafayette, Chris Morisivica, Star City News.